My beautiful wife. Mwah. And let's eat. Ta da! Ta da! Ta da! Ta da! Yes. Mm. Oh, chicken. Mm. Guys, if you have never tried to eat hot food on top, of fresh leaves and it doesn't matter which kind of leaves it can be lettuces it can be um, like I have a uh, rucola lemony rucola or spinach or whatever you prefer it's so good with the food you just have no idea some of the leaves will wilt some of the leaves will stay crunchy lovely mm. Mm. And I think and it's very good. And then I got the mushroom bite. And mm -hmm. mushrooms are really nice. Oops. Yeah. Oops. Yeah. <laughs> the mushroom bites and the chicken bites. Mm -hmm. The green beans bite. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Today was one of those days that I don't want to shop. I had some food inside the refrigerator, but I didn't have a lot of components to eat, for what I'm thinking. So, um, yeah, I just took Thrive Live and it's so convenient that it's just on the shelf and Regina now it's a bit she's a bit obsessed with chicken somehow she really wants all, all the time chicken so I didn't I didn't have you know chicken uh, breast or something that defrost fat I only have you know one whole chicken that takes forever to defrost and I forgot uh, to, to take it out in the morning I'm sorry honey so I made this chicken and I love that it's you know drying on my shelf waiting for me. Mm. Simplifies mm. the life. Mm. And sometimes we all want simple life. Mm -hmm. As well as she's going to work. And she needs <coughs> something for the night to eat. So I love to do this type of dishes with different components that she can take for work. By the way, we just were talking with uh, RL. Oh. Like, you actually was talking with RL. But that how we, um, you know, <coughs> one of the ways to to um, be frugal or like not to spend a lot of money, it's not never, it's, you never ate in her hospital, I think, with the years that you Never. Never. Never, never. I never bought anything in the hospital since they started working. Mm -hmm. Ever. Nothing, nothing, mm -hmm. nothing. And and yeah, and this uh, whatever I don't eat I'm gonna take with me for my night shift. Yeah. <clears throat> and if you see my face when I, she said I have to go to work, it's because I'm tired. Mm-hmm. 
I worked already numerous night shifts and I had to stay today for a day shift and do pull like 16 hours because there was no replacement. Okay. I know. So I'm like, you know. <laughs> I like and I couldn't leave. And you know. Often I like to do overtime, but today I was just like, really? <laughs> you know, some days you're just like done. I'm sorry, honey, that you had to do it. Oh, that's okay, it happens. Anyway, that was my little bit. But she said I have to go to work on it. <laughs> my last night shift, choo choo. <laughs> but yeah, about. Um... <laughs> sorry. Oh well. Mmm. Yeah, like we normally don't, um, like the tip that they suggest you to save money. Every article I read starts with, ah, oh, don't buy coffee outside. Make one at home before you leave the home. I rarely do it. Like we do it sometimes, but, but just for fun, kind of, you know, if you need to unwind or you're somewhere and you just, you know, it's kind of nice. But again, rarely. I know a lot of people that just, you know, come to work and I see them carrying their coffee all the time and we kind of did the simple math if when your coffee costs a couple of bucks it's end up being a lot of money throughout the year and then definitely never bought a lunch as well like as you mentioned so just oh. bring my own stuff oh you know like I, I saw statistic I'm not sure if it's uh, true or not but um, in the United States more than 40 percent food thrown away and mostly by families so basically, what happens if you buy food and um, and you don't eat it? Basically, it's money thrown away. It's basically you can go and throw everything. So it's like it shocked me actually because I'm trying if I can't eat it, I'm always freezing something. I have sure. tons of freezing pre-cooked food, and you know what? Sometimes when I'm trying to um, to do something like like chilies and like um, yeah. Stuff like this. Things. And by the way, that's why I really love Try Life. It's because they're just standing on the shelf, not in the refrigerator, it doesn't go bad. It's tasty, it's healthy, it's have most of the nutrition because it's you know freeze dry. Dry, so No, it definitely makes some um, life simple when you're just not up to it. Mm hmm And it, it's and it's chicken. <laughs> yeah. And seriously me and Ariel seems to be fans of this chicken. We can just grab it, open the box, and eat it freeze dry. Victoria is always shocked, but we like it. I'm like, it'd be great. Actually, we're talking about going like um, backpacking and grab all our stuff with us. <laughs> I know, I was looking. <laughs> yeah, she was looking better, and I knew that it won't. <laughs> yeah, welcome to my world. Well, you know. You know. Yeah. Go on uh, backpacking, um, you know, adventure when you grab all your stuff, including your food. And it's also like a challenge, right? The packages and stuff. Mm -hmm. But seriously, if you grab this chicken, me and Ariel would be fine. I know. You can just grab this. It's great. Actually, mushrooms are tasty as well. I mean, in frozen state. Actually, I really like the mushrooms. I was going to mention about the mushrooms. Those mushrooms are amazing. They're Tastes flavorful better than the fresh one. I know. You know what? I, I, I learned a long time ago that dry mushrooms, if you want soup, stews, or um, mushrooms, you know, creamy mushroom soup, and you use only fresh mushrooms, it's, gonna it's bang never bang. good. So I'm, I'm sorry that I'm looking down a lot because I have bright light in front of my eyes and it's bothering me, so I tend to look down. It's sunglasses. Yeah, really. So. Um, Always, 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 when you, when you do mushrooms, mushroom or mushroom soup, add some dry mushrooms. Uh, I usually use shiitake mushrooms in all my soups and stews and gravies and etc. because it has such a woodsy, mushroomy, fla deep mushroomy flavor. Concentrated flavor. Yeah, because the ones that you if you use, just fresh ones, they tend to be kind of like watery almost, right? And the flavor is not concentrated. All of I love fresh mushrooms. Mm -hmm. But... Even I if like you them. fry them for quite a long time, so yeah. And those are, I like this actually better than just mm. the regular dried mushrooms. Mm -hmm. It mm. has this 
texture to it. I love yeah. my different textures. Just grab one mushroom and just try it. Totally, it's, it's, it's a lot. Mm -hmm. Mushrooms are great. Mm -hmm. Did you try it? Mm -hmm. What? Yeah, there's mm -hmm. bite to it and this kind of like um, deep woodsy, woodsy and, and the texture and I don't know, just like. Yeah. So this is very nice. Mm. For the days when you feel meh, when you feel done. <laughs> Very done. I mean, not just done. What happened? I went to Costco. We went to Costco and we bought only three things. And I, di and I didn't go to a um, superstore when I usually buy all my produce. So I didn't have a lot of produce. And I didn't have chicken that I wanted, you know, to cut. So I thought, oh, okay, I, have, I still have those uh, beauties. So let's let's whip up something. So I found the cre cream cheese and I found you know the, the regular cheese. So I have like mixed and match, and a lot of time it saves because you know what, I didn't have mushrooms. I didn't have a lot of things. Uh, green beans. I don't know why in our Costco, green beans are we not always have uh, green beans. I mean the organic ones that I Actually, really love. Actually, most of the time don't really have them. Mm -hmm. It is like they bring one batch once a year and that's it. Unfortunately. Yeah, I know. American Costco is just so much better. Oh my god, it's so much better. Yeah. And I always, if I uh, see the green beans, the frozen green beans, I'm uh, totally... She gets all excited. Always, uh, you should see her. She gets so excited about the green beans. It's weird. Because it's my own favorite vegetable. It's weird. Like they're good, but she gets all excited. It's better to be excited about the green beans than other things, you know. Like sweet. Ariel actually is extremely excited about green beans too. He mm -hmm. loves them fried with the soy sauce and garlic and they're very simple. Garlic makes everything better. Always. Mm -hmm. And onion. Yeah. I love garlic and onion. Great that we are all on the same page. That would help. It helps a lot. I mean, that helps. That would help. That in general yeah. it helps. What mm -hmm. am I saying? Mm. Mm. This is really tasty. It's good. Actually, she didn't like how it looks before the pasta. Because it was too liquidy. I don't know. Am I making a soupy something? When, when it happens, when you know, you pop them in the middle of someone else's cooking, it's like, what are you doing? Yeah, no. Mm. Just happy I don't have to cook. No, you have to cook in the middle of all this shit. Or in general. Mm. It's a great salad. Mm? Mm -hmm. She likes her greeny arugula. You know what? Arugula is one of my f most time favorite um, greens. Yeah, and she really she aimed to go to Costco to buy her spin spinach. Yeah. I needed spinach and eggs. And we bought, yeah, but we talk about it already. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Mm. Where is that mushroom? Mm. mushroom? Sorry for doing it or not sorry. Because I needed to drink it, it's so good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. After living in Canada for over 10 years, the sorry sticks to you. It seems to be more mm. to you than to me. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Yes. It's okay. Oh, yeah. You enjoyed it? You committed no crime? Go for it, girl. Mm. Enjoy your soupiness. Soupiness. <laughs> yeah. She That's likes her soupinesses. I love a lot of um, soupy consistency. Yeah, for sure. Very much. Yep. So that's that. This bow tie is so have? cute. I just want to put one in here. Please don't. No. It will smell bad. Because I'm not like you. 
<laughs> That's a lender. It does lend there all the time. So yeah, go into my lab. So yeah, if you want to get this, please go to the link below and get those packages. They're looking as I saw like like this, and they're dry, dry vegetables inside that. Wow. Doesn't it smell good? Oh. Mm hmm It's very peppery. Mm -hmm. It's like it's concentrated. Because it's dried, the flavors are a bit more concentrated than yeah, regular one. Yes, we need less. Probably will give less, less when you add to your food. Definitely. Because it brings up the flavor way more. Definitely, because it's so concentrated. It's very tasty. So yeah, go to the links down there, I mean in the description box, and uh, check it out. Yeah, there are uh, shipping to Canada, United States, Japan, and Puerto Rico, I think. I could be wrong, but f to numerous uh, countries, and it's amazing. So yeah, what else? Yeah. So thank you so very much for being with us and Thanks please guys subscribe, for joining. write us a comment, thumbs up us and cheers. Loving love and life love. and remember, go to what you enjoy and do something fun every day. And if you didn't understand, we are affiliated with this, uh, with a Thrive Life, but we thoroughly, we really thoroughly enjoy it all the time. We, we do, so we tried we it for, for a long time before we decided to join them and support their products. At least three mm. months. Because I wanted to see how they work and uh, what they present and how the food is. And, and try different recipes. Yeah. So, so yeah. see you next time. Mwah.